I've got many things that go through my head during the game. Not all of them good, I have to say. Well, we just go back to basics. You try to forget about uh, the poor shots, reinforce your, your mind with the good shots that you've hit, and uh, get over the next one and do the best you can. If you can do the best you can over every shot and every putt, then you know, you're going to be feeling an awful lot better about yourself when you come off the course than uh, if you don't. You know, a lot of guys end up worrying too much with their swing or what's happened, what's caused the shot that they've just hit, as opposed to getting on with things and um, trying to figure out whatever the best way is of recovering or um, to get out of the trouble that they've gotten into. And I've certainly been, been uh, guilty of that in the past, but uh, you know, if you're, if you're mentally strong and you can get over your bad shots, accept them, move on to the next one, um, that's what differentiates the winners from the ultra round. You know, a lot of amateurs tend to keep their scores as they're going round and, well, I'm one over now, I'm three over, I'm five over, whatever. But, uh, you know, one of the best things a lot is, is forget about your score and concentrate on each and every shot and add them up at the end of the round. And that way he'll have a much more enjoyable day and a much lower score. He's very fortunate, very lucky to be out there on a, on a, on a lush bit of, of grass, hitting a little golf ball around, a, um, trying to get into a little hole. And a lot of people f forget how fortunate they are to get out there and play. So forget about the score and try and enjoy it. And that in turn will lower people's scores. Original content every day. Channel B. Join us.